chapter 14, verse 3. Therefore, they stayed there for a long time, speaking boldly in the Lord, who is bearing witness to the word of His grace, granting signs and wonders to be done by their hands. Of course, we are talking about Zeus and Hermes. <laughs> I'm joking about Paul and Barnabas. Coincidentally, they were known as Barnabas and Paul initially. But uh, there are a lot of things I want to share about this passage. The first thing is boldness. Therefore, they stayed a long time speaking boldly in the Lord. Boldness is different from courage. Courage is what you have. You can be courageous about everything and anything or nothing else. Yes? But boldness is what comes from the Lord. When you have boldness, you better watch out. Yes, because the Lord gives it. It says, speaking boldly in the Lord. Yes, so the Lord gives the boldness you need whenever you need to speak. And however long you need to stay the Lord. I love you who gives you the grace to do that. And more than that, when you speak the word, what does it say? Was bearing, the Lord was bearing witness to the word of his grace. Hallelujah. He bears witness to his word. Hallelujah. And granting signs and wonders to be done by the hands. See, it made a difference what they did because it was done by the hands, but the Lord followed it through by the signs and wonders he did through the hands. So you must go, therefore, and be the hands of the Lord. And when you don't have boldness and where you don't have boldness, he gives you that boldness. I'm not a person that is courageous by nature, but hallelujah, when the boldness comes on me, like I said, watch out, watch out, hallelujah, need the boldness in the Lord, yes, so it makes you faithful, in our unfaithfulness, he remains faithful, hallelujah, and Paul and Barnabas, even though they were almost killed, because uh, initially they were worshipped as Zeus and Hermes, as I was joking, but then when they said, no, we are men like you, they were almost killed, yes, even though they were killed, they had the boldness to preach the gospel even afterwards. Hallelujah. So should you. So should you. Yes, you should have the boldness, no matter what, to overcome. To overcome the situation, to overcome life itself. For oh, we are overcomers. Hallelujah. In Jesus Christ. Mm -hmm.